After more than a decade of U.S. presence in Afghanistan, women here continue to experience the highest rates of abuse and violence in the world. Yet, despite this grim fact, securing human rights for women in Afghanistan has made headway. For 12 years, Women for Afghan Women has provided life-saving services for women and children who have been impoverished and physically and psychologically damaged by decades of violence. For the past six years, its lawyers have been accessing justice for women in Afghan courts and demanding that their assailants be prosecuted. شیرینی مدادا شیرینی خوری کردم بعد از این کار بردن چل چل پنج سال آدم و قبولش نداشتم فکر نمی کردم فکر می کردم که دخانه چی کنم داری نمی فامیدم از این که دباغ مرا ببرم بی ایسید بی آبرو اول اول چاکو بعد دستم زدن بعد از یک پوشه پدر بعدش که سر من تا کردم چاکو از دست خود کشیدم سه چاکو در کمرم سر باز بعد از کمرم یک پوشه ای طرف موند یک پوشه ای طرف مثل که دو گزبند می کشیم تو سرم وار که در افریقا همی طرف گلنو پیش که کلی می خود اخواندم از وقتی که بچه خود زدی یکیش مرد گفت مرد دیگهش گفت بنداز چا دیگه در روش دمو و اصلا با اونش بودم میفهمیدم ندایم هم داخل کردم اما تا ساخت شدم ساخت شدم نفر با خدا آب میزد برقای دستی در پیشارم بود دیگه انداختن سر ما دیگه خیلی در روی جویه بودم و شمال در جان رو میزد من میخونه رد کلا داری تا میخ زده بودم پایی میخونه بسیار لرسی میگرفت باز من قسمت خودم تو بسته کردم به یک زخطی گفتم پدرم برادرم میکاره کردم After being treated in hospital, Zakia was taken to a shelter that was being run by Women for Afghan Women where she has been recovering for the past year. Women come to the shelters because they've been tortured by the families uh, they've been sold, they've been burned. No one should be treated the way that some women are treated uh, for any kind of honor. There's no honor in this, in, 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 in punishing a woman. When they first come, they're broken. You can see that they, they want nothing, they like nothing. You know, even for the first few weeks, they, they don't want to um, be involved in the literacy classes or the vocational classes. But after a while, when, when they're in the shelter, you can see that, you know, they're a different, they're a different person. <laughs> women for Afghan women had never before encountered a case like Gomina's. Women for Afghan Women brought her to Kabul for emergency medical care and support. She could not speak or remember what had happened to her. Now at the shelter, through physiotherapy and counseling, she is learning how to talk again. 
Women for Afghan Women, is working on her divorce. They arrive at the shelters as victims, but quickly discover their confidence and self-worth. Women for Afghan Women now operate shelters in eight of Afghanistan's 34 provinces, providing women and girls with safety from abuse and with education, particularly literacy classes and education about their human rights. Well, when a woman comes to, to our shelter and she's never gone to school before, and then she spends three or four months in our shelter, and, I, and when I go to the shelter and I see that she's in, in the literacy class, and that, of course, puts a smile on, on my face. And it also empowers her when she knows how to tell time, how to count money for the first time ever. Um, you know, that, that, that's what keeps me going. Yes, it's going to take a long time, maybe a generation, maybe two generations to change culture. But we're doing it one step at a time, and it's going to happen eventually. The organization has also opened three residences for children who had been living in prisons with their mothers, some for their entire lives. Having been starved for education and a normal childhood, the children embrace the opportunity to be in school and to live in a safe and supportive environment. Many rise to the top of their class. Violence against women doesn't stop or disappear in just a few years. It's, it's, it's hard work, but I see, I see, we see differences. The, the girls in this country motivate me, the women in our shelters motivate me. So I'll be very happy when, when, we, need, when we have to shut down our doors because no woman in this country needs our services. That's going to be success. <laughs>